I guess we're starting things off with Youngster Joey. Yo, Ryan, how's it going? This is Joey. Got a minute? Let's get together and battle. I promise things will be different. Route 30 is where I'll be. Give me a shot when you come. Alright, later. Uh, sorry Joey, I don't think I'm going to be heading over to Route 30 anytime soon. Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, we did quite a few things here actually. First off, what we did was we took on the Azalea Town Pokemon Gym Leader Bugsy and we ran into our rival Devonta and we had one hell of a showdown that was I can't even put into words that was a great battle my boy Gert came through with freaking amazingness god this man is a stud <laughs> oh man it was amazing anyways today ladies and gentlemen we're going to be heading onwards to Ilax Forest and yeah without further ado let's go ahead and get this thing started a little spooky See what this guy has to say. Oh man, my boss is going to be steaming. The far fetch that cuts trees for charcoal took off on me. I can't go looking for it here in the Ilax Forest. It's too big, dark, and scary for me. Did I get repels? If I didn't, I'm honestly about to go get some because I ain't trying to run into no level 5 Caterpies. I'm, I'm pretty sure I did. I'm like 99.9% .9 sure I did. I did. Okay, cool. I did lie. I said in the last episode that we were going to be catching our fourth Pokemon. We aren't going to be doing that until next episode, so. It's the missing Pokemon. Farfetch'd. Wow. This thing's pretty easy to snag. Just, you want to go around. There's a few things to grab here. But, I'm recording this on Sunday, January 18th. And I'm watching the NFL Championship game. AFC and it's going pretty wacky right now the Chiefs are amazing I shouldn't be saying that I'm a Denver fan but who cares pretty much what you want to do is you just want to walk all the way around and then just walk down here and he should go down there yep it's pretty simple the first time I played this I got really confused for some reason because maybe I'm like really stupid but there we go so once we head up here I'll talk to this man again wow thanks a whole bunch my boss's Pokemon won't obey me because I won't because I don't have a badge. Ah, oh, my farfetched! You found it for us, kid. Without it, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for charcoal. Thanks, kid. Now, how can I thank you? I know. Here, take this. We got HMO one. HMO one is our first HM, as you can obviously tell, because it's HMO one. That's cut. Cut is absolutely amazing. Of course, you have to have the badge for Zelia Town to use it. We don't have a Pokemon to do to uh, use Cut, so I'm just gonna go run around and find a Paris. And Paris is actually from the like freaking Flash and Cut, all that jazz. I'm gonna go just run around until I find one, and I'll just meet you guys back here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I caught ourselves a Paris. What are we gonna name this Paris? Um. Uh. You know what? We're gonna name it France, because Paris, Paris, France. I hope uh, that's. I hope that's the same place. If it's not, I'm gonna look like a real idiot. We're just gonna name it France. Because I think it's funny. Anyways, we're gonna head back to town real quick. Forgot repel real. My peril. My, my repel wore off. Oh yeah, we gotta teach our cut. We gotta teach cut to France. Cut. Oh, never mind. We do have Flash already. How the, where did we get Flash at? I don't even remember. <laughs> France learned Cut. Alright, we're going to teach him Flash too. There we go. Perfect. Perfecto. Please don't run at anything else. Okay, perfect. 
So the reason I'm going back here is because remember when I said that you could get a charcoal for free? Well, you can. Just go down to this house after helping the Farfetch, and this guy should be in here. Yep. You chased off Team Rocket and went to I Like Taurus alone. That takes guts. I like that. Come train with us. Maybe it's not that guy. Come here, loser. I'm so sorry. I forgot to thank you. This is charcoal that I made. Fire type Pokemon would be happy to hold that. We got charcoal. More does it just raises the uh, attack power of fire type Pokemon, so I'm gonna go ahead and slap that bad Jesse on our boy. Vulcan. Where we're at. There we go. Give uh, Vulcan. There we go. I'm just gonna let uh, what's his face sit at 1 HP. <coughs> oh, my, my bad. I just sneeze. I didn't want to get it on camera. So how are you guys' day going today? It's going pretty good. Just, just chilling on a Sunday. No one's here, so I thought I'd just make a quick little video. Nothing too big. What we're going to just do today is we're just going to make it through Ilex Forest, and that's pretty much it. Getting used for more our boy France. So this is the Ilex Forest Shrine. It's an honor of the forest is protected. You can do a... Uh, uh, event here, but you have to cheat it. Well, yeah, you have to cheat it in, and then you you pretty much get a um, what's the Pokemon called? A Celebi. I like forces over so overgrown with trees that you can't see the sky. Please, please watch out for items that may have been dropped. Yes. See, I when I first originally like wanted to do this let's play, I wanted to somehow put or somehow do that. But there's like no way, there's no chance that I'm going to be able to do that. If I was playing on a different emulator, then yes, there would be an option for me to cheat and get that in. But the, emul the emulator that I'm playing on, you can't uh, cheat things on. So, it's no big deal. So we're going to head down here because we're going to get actually something very, very nice and useful. We're going to talk to this guy. What am I doing? I'm shaking trees into your headbutt. It's fun. Here, you try it too. A TM of two, headbutt. Headbutt is great. It's an actually a very powerful attack, and you can go ahead and use use it on trees. Uh, was that it? Okay, there we go. Headbutt. Who are we gonna teach this to? I'm going to teach this to Vulcan. Dang, Vulcan just getting everything today. Don't go too fast, cause I don't want to get rid of Ember. Uh, I'm just gonna get rid of. Should I get rid of tackle or leer? Yeah, I'm getting rid of tackle. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe we'll use leer in the near future. Oh. So making our way through Ilex Forest. It's been a long day. Time to see my fluffy dog. Alright, I don't know what I'm talking about. This is very actually a short forest. Surprisingly, there aren't like any trainer battles. <sighs> well, <laughs> never mind, I guess. There is a trainer battle. Bucket Chihuahua. Dude, that was actually amazing timing. <laughs> I actually, I totally forgot that there was a, 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 one trainer battle. It might be two, I don't even remember, but. That was actually amazing time. <laughs> switch out the Vulcan. God, that was actually amazing. I couldn't have done that again if I tried. That literally just one damage to me. <laughs> Whack. There we go. Paris! You mean France. Am I right? I don't know, I feel like Paris's cry is actually is one of the most like well known. Alongside Geo dude. But uh, that could just be me. I don't even know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Alright Wayne, get out of here, you freaking nerd. I think I can get your phone number, but I don't want your phone number, so I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> 
In Heart Gold and Soul Silver, I believe there is a photographer here that you can take photos with uh, your Pokemon, but I could be wrong. I do remember there being a photographer somewhere, but I don't. I think it was there. Do you see that shine honoring the protector? It watches over the forest from across time. I think that must be a grass type Pokemon. I mean, you are right. Oh well, honey, you're making a Pokedex. It must be hard if Pokemon won't appear. Try using this TM. What is this? I've never gotten this one before. It's a sweet set. Oh, oh yeah, you can use this outside of battle and attract Pokemon to you. That's kind of cool. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're on Route 34. This is where we're actually be catching our new Pokemon. And I'm not gonna do it until next episode because we got a lot of trainer battles here. So let's go. Who we got first? Who we got first on the agenda? This is where I do. This is where I do my training. Oh yeah, there is one battle here that is actually important to to do because if we get something from this uh, trainer uh, later in the game from via phone call. So I said phone call and I put like a phone signal up on my hand. Wow, I'm a little cool. Should actually let Gert get some of the time so he can uh, evolve. Dang, Zeta? Zeta's probably gonna get to level 16, so I'll probably get him here. And then, we will just go ahead and switch on to get. Never mind. He's got four Pokemon, so. Oh, this I am going to switch. It's great having a water type Pokemon. I honestly think water type might be my favorite Pokemon type. If I could have like my own gym. I would definitely have a water type gym that be filled with uh, quack sires. All, all of my trainers would have quack, quack sires, and I would have like five quack sires, all like level 50. It'd be the first gym in the game, but you know, hey, why not? <laughs> no, if I was actually to make my own gym, it would it would be a water type gym. Um, I would. Oh, screw it, I'm just gonna stay out. I would probably have. I'd probably make it the uh, like sixth or fifth gym, like right in the middle. But I'd probably have. Hmm. What are some of my favorite Walt type Pokemon? I definitely have a uh, a Quagsire as my ace, like level 30, 35 maybe. Um. Oh man, who do I want? kind of hard. Maybe I'll take a, uh, uh, what's his name? Oh, I have it on the tip of my tongue. It's like water and ground type. Uh, like, gosh. It's like cash something. I can't remember its name. I'm drawing a fat blade. You know what? This is too hard. I can't, I can't think of water type Pokemon that I would actually use. Oh my god. Dirt is a stud. Freaking beast. Alright, Samuel. Get out of here. We're gonna head up to this way, over this little patch of land where that female is standing. Because we actually need to fight her and talk to her. Oh, this is Abra. Hey, Abra. I'm surprised her freaking egg has a hatch yet. Let's see if we can kill it in one hit. Oh, of course not. You probably get a lot of experience from killing Abra. Yeah, they flee every single time, so don't even try to fight it. Are you a trainer? Let's have a practice battle. Okay, I guess. I think you have like a hop or something. I could be wrong. No, oh, I was right. <laughs> Dude, I'm so afraid. I heard being just been brain sometimes. Sometimes, sometimes. <laughs> well, I actually did a lot. Surprisingly. I don't know how much crunch or not crunch bite would be. Let's find out. Oh, uh, a hell of a lot more. <laughs> Bam! Level 16. Bulbasaur. I'm switching that to our boy Vulcan. Is that we can actually get another egg? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I totally forgot that we could do that. Yeah, we can get it like this route. So. Freaking dope. I don't want to kill the Bulbasaur, it's my favorite, but I guess I gotta do what I gotta do. Level 20. 
First Pokemon to reach level 20 on our team. Dope. Hop it. Sorry, it's on the TV right now. This is some Shakira. Some Shakira. Sorry, I don't really even know what to talk about. I'm just rambling on and on. Hope you guys enjoy that. But we got Gina. So we're gonna actually go ahead and talk to Gina after we get out of here. Bam! You're too strong to be a practice partner. Whenever I see a strong trainer, I want to be the cheerleader. When I'm on the walk sometimes, I pick up items. If I get anything, you can have it. Yes, give me your phone number, but please don't call me every two seconds. That would suck. I need to hurry up. Halftime's already over. I'm gonna try and skip most of these battles. I'll do them off screen. Okay. Eh. Okay, if we head in here, this is the daycare. I think we've talked to this lady right here. I'm the daycare lady. Do you know about eggs? My husband and I were raising some Pokemon, you see. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible could that be? Should I raise it for you? No. Come again. Alright, let's talk to the mans. I'm the daycare man. Do you know about eggs? I was raising Pokemon with my wife, you see. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible is that? Well, wouldn't you like this egg? It's fine. Okay. I got an odd egg. Awesome. We got two eggs now. Let's, let's check on... Check on our egg, actually. This egg is taking a hot minute to crack. This is going to hatch soon, but... Dude, we got a long ways to go for this guy. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and move this to the... Okay, guess not. Switch, France, and egg. There we go. Alright. Let's go ahead and walk down a little bit farther so Cotman doesn't see us. Bam. Please don't see me, I beg of you. Okay, cool. And with that, ladies... I got stuck. I literally couldn't move. Anyways, with this, ladies and gentlemen, we are just actually going ahead and end things off here. I'm gonna go ahead and fight these trainers off screen so I can get some, so I can get Zeta some experience. Oh. <laughs> Before we do that, our egg cracked. Wow, amazing. Let's see who's in it. I already know who's in it. It's a freaking Togepi. Togepi is the dopest Pokemon. Togepi came out of its egg. Wow! Just so imagine if I was using this Togepi. We're gonna actually name it. You know what? Let's name it Sunnyside. Because it's a type of egg. We can name it Boiled. Oh, dude. We're gonna just name it Boiled. Actually, no. We're just gonna name it Sunnyside. It's a dope name. I'm not gonna use this, though, but. Just go ahead and name all our Pokemon, because why not? Uh, S, there you are. S, I, oh, I can name it Sunny Side Up. No, oh, no, man, Sunny Side. There we go. Dope nickname. If that, ladies and gentlemen, we have entered Goldenrod City. Woo! With that, ladies and gentlemen, I think we're going to end things off here today. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Pokemon Crystal. If you want to enjoy, please go ahead and leave a like if you haven't yet. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the notification bell directly next to the subscribe button so you always get notified whenever I post another banger. Next time on Pokemon Crystal, we're going to be exploring the vast city of Goldenrod. So, hope you guys stay tuned. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Remember, stay sexy because you're the real MVP. <laughs> Yo, what's up? It's Raymond here. It's really fucking <laughs> late here. Yes, Derek. Yes. Derek the rapper.